Good day. Yeah. Hi. Welcome to the Kids Bible Biz. <laughs> I'm Jono. And I'm Heaven. And we are so glad you've joined us. Thanks so much for watching. It's so good to see you. Today, we're going to be looking at the story of Zacchaeus. Yeah, this is a great story. Sometimes in life, there are people who are heading in one direction and then they meet Jesus and it completely changes them and turns them around. Yeah, that's what happened to Zacchaeus. And all he cared about was being rich and getting what he wanted. But then he met Jesus and it changed his life. That's it. Zacchaeus became a completely different person, a much kinder person and a much happier person. I love that. I love how God can help us change and become more like him. All right, so let's hear the story. We're going to tell it and then we'll ask some questions. All right, let's go. Let's go. Jesus and his disciples traveled to a town called Jericho. In Jericho, there was a man named Zacchaeus. Zacchaeus was the town's chief tax collector. His job was to collect money from the people and to give it to the government. Yeah, but Zacchaeus was heaps dodgy. He would collect extra money and keep it for himself. This made Zacchaeus very rich, but it also made him very unpopular. No one liked Zacchaeus. He was a dishonest thief. He ripped people off and he didn't care about the people he was stealing from. When Zacchaeus heard that Jesus was coming to town, he decided to go check it out. He wanted to see who Jesus was. So he left his tax booth and went up the road to where Jesus was going to pass by. Already, there was a big crowd lining the street. And because Zacchaeus was such a short man, he couldn't see anything. Yeah, all he could see was the backs of people in front of him. Very frustrating. Mm -hmm. Zacchaeus saw that further down the road was a big sycamore fig tree. So he ran ahead and climbed the tree. From up in the tree, Zacchaeus could see everything. He could see Jesus walking down the road, slowly passing through the crowd. Yeah, but when Jesus got to the spot where Zacchaeus was, he stopped. Jesus looked straight up at Zacchaeus and called out to him. Zacchaeus, Jesus said, come down from the tree. I'm gonna stay at your place tonight. Zacchaeus couldn't believe it. Jesus was speaking to him. How did Jesus even know his name? Zacchaeus raced down the tree and welcomed Jesus gladly. Full of excitement, he led Jesus back to his home. And later, back at Zacchaeus' house, Jesus and Zacchaeus shared a meal together. Mm -hmm. They talked for hours. Zacchaeus was so amazed by Jesus. He had never met someone so good and so kind. Yeah, and so wise. Mm -hmm. Jesus seemed to know everything. He would always say the right thing. It was clear to Zacchaeus that Jesus was someone special and that he cared about him. Mm -hmm. Well, right there and then, Zacchaeus made a decision. He stood up and in front of everyone said, I'm not gonna be a cheat anymore. I'm gonna give half of everything I have to the poor. And to all the people I've ripped off, I will pay them back four times the amount I stole. Wow, that was a huge decision. Zacchaeus was going to stop being a thief and pay back all the money he had taken. People were amazed to hear Zacchaeus say this. And Jesus, Jesus was so happy. He stood next to Zacchaeus and said, I have come to find lost people who need saving. That's why God sent me. And today this man is saved. Salvation comes to this house today. I like that Zacchaeus was desperate to see Jesus, that he even climbed a tree so that he could get just a glimpse of him. Even though they did bad stuff and was and rob people and steal from people. He gave them a purpose. I liked how Zacchaeus decided to turn back to God and started to do good deeds after he talked with God. It tells me that Jesus knows everything that's going around him. It doesn't like matter if you're like not as popular as others, that Jesus will still love you. But Jesus cares for everyone, even a tax collector. This story shows that, that it reminds me that I can be friends with anyone. No matter what you're like or what you do, Jesus will stick with you. When you invite Jesus into your life, he should change you completely like he did for Zacchaeus, that he gave four times as much to everyone he stole from. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Thanks, guys. That was great. For me, this story reminds me that I can always turn my life back to Jesus. If I've been doing the wrong thing, it's never too late to ask God for help or to forgive me, to help me change. That's great. 
Hey, I'd like to pray if that's all right. When we pray, we talk to God and we can talk to God about anything. Yeah, we can ask God to help us, to forgive us, to make us more like Him. Or we can thank God for things, like the good things in our lives. Exactly. So if you would like to pray with me, you can close your eyes or you can just listen. Thank you, God, so much for these kids. Lord, I just pray that these kids come to know you for themselves through these videos. We just pray that in Jesus' name. Amen. All right. Let's do these questions, hey? Got three questions for you. What did you like about this story? What does this story tell you about Jesus? And how can this story help you in life? That's all for today, kids. We'll see you next week. Next week. Bye. Yee. Ha, ha, ha.